Hi there. Today I'm going to show you a great little tip or trick that will uh, help you uh, solve uh, your Sudoku puzzles. And in this case we're looking at the number 7. So we can see here there's a fair few numbers here in these uh, six boxes on the right, but there's nothing much over here on the left. And we can see there that uh, all the 7s, we've got all the 7s over here on those uh, right six boxes. And we're going to use those sevens to have a look and solve uh, some of the sevens over in the uh, left-hand side. So if you think about it, then we've got uh, we've got that row with a seven, so a seven can't appear in that row over in this uh, left-hand side. Uh, there's seven there in that row, seven in that row, seven in that row, seven in that row, and seven in that row. So we're left with three rows that uh, don't have a seven in it, and we've got one. Uh, one there, and we've got uh, two boxes there, and two boxes there, so there's got to be three sevens spread in amongst those seven uh, seven cells there on the left hand side. And if you think about it, with this row here obviously we've got a nine there already, and a four there already, so that limit is just with two cells that uh, can be a seven, so if you think of it not sure which ones are going to be so, but imagine if you're going to have a seven there. If a seven's there, then a seven's got to be there, or vice versa. If it's seven's in that bottom left, then the seven's going to be in the uh, the top right. But either way, then whichever seven, whichever combinations you've only got two combinations of seven, then that means that a seven can't be in that cell there because it's going to be in one of those. And then it can't be in that cell there a seven because you're gonna have a seven in one of those cells. And so that leaves you with this cell here on the right as the only one that uh that can you definitely know that uh, it's gotta be a seven. So you can see there that even though you don't know which cell's gonna be the seven, you can see there with the process of elimination that you're gonna have a seven in one of those. And that stops you having a 7 there, stops you having a 7 there, and the only one left is going to be that cell there, which is your 7.